During last night's Blender Royale, Andreas added glare to his cycles render. Let's take a look at what he done. Alright guys, how's it going? A very quick video tutorial for today, and I'm going to show you how to use the glare node inside of the compositing tab, so we can add this nice bloom effect to our cycles render. Now this is pretty easy to do to be honest, I have a PBR background, I have a nice text object which has an emission channel, and the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly go into the compositing tab, in order to use compositing, what we need to do is we need to enable use nodes. Generally, what you will find is it brings up the render layers in the compositing node. Now, I would like to view what I'm actually doing to work, so I'll press Shift and A, S to search, and I'll drop down the viewer node. And what I'll do is I'll take an image and I'll plug this in, and hopefully we can see the image in the background. Now, the glare node is pretty self-explanatory, to be honest. I'll press Shift and A, S to search, and I'll search for glare. Let's plug this in between the image and the viewer and you will immediately start to get feedback on what we're doing to the image. Now when it comes to the glare node, there's a few things we can actually play around with. We can change this to something like ghosts, that kind of blows everything out to be honest, or we can go to a simple star, we can change this maybe down to low, and you can start to see this nice star effect. Now generally, most people will use fog glow, they might change it to high because it kind of pulls in the blacks just a little bit, and that's us, we have a nice emission glow. Now, in order to save the composite image, what we can do is we can actually click on the viewer node, bring up the property panel on the right hand side, and you can see here, inside of item, save this image. And that'll quickly save out the image that you're working on. If you want to do this, for example, in an animation, you can plug the image back into the composite. And that's you pretty much done. That's how you add glare inside of cycles. Do me a favour guys, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, cost you absolutely nothing, follow me on all the social media links, you know what to do. Take care.